This year's I Am Hip Hop honoree not only made sure the world knew her sound, she made sure the world knew her. And her name is Trina. <laughs> Mama took flight in 98 when y'all ain't no net. She told y'all she was the baddest chick. She has the kind of swag that a boss like me could appreciate. And she's kicked down the door to body positivity. And over 20 years later, she still got her foot on necks applying pressure. Paving the way for sisters to be free, fierce, and unapologetic. Trina stood toe to toe with some of the biggest names in hip hop. And she is still standing, still creating, still paving the way for the next generation of female MCs. She's a collaborator with natural ability to reinvent herself, creating new sounds with artists like Lotto and Sweetie, to name a few. And these days, you can even find her tossing wrestlers around in the ring. Just a reminder that sis ain't never been one to back down. I'm proud to call you friend and my sister in hip hop. You still one of the boldest, and more importantly, you will always be the baddest. <laughs> Fearless. Definitely a, a trailblazer. Somebody the way she walks. Raw. The icon. Period. With over 20 years of success in the music industry, Trina and her fearless approach to lyricism originally exploded out of Miami, where she began her reign as the queen of the South. The music scene was more bass music, fun music. I just loved the scene of the music, and then it just went from there to trick. I met Trina growing up in the Poker Bean Projects. Our music was stuck. When you talk about the call and response, you're talking about Trina and Trick. We created a monster. Man. I say, that's it right there. It was one of the things I was like, I don't even believe that's me. It was just me thinking about I got to go nastier than Trick. When I heard it now, I tell everybody, I had to stop everything we're doing, and we got to get Trina in a contract. Ow. Turning out more hits like Shut Up, Pull Over, and The Baddest Chick, Trina's unfiltered attitude on the mic forever changed the culture and inspired the new generation of MCs. I feel like me and Miami, I feel she inspired us in some ways, the way we rap, the our attitude, mm -hmm. everything. Trina is going to uplift women in the most authentic, raw, uncut way possible. Trina has so much staying power, and she is one of the most consistent artists in this business. I feel like she deserves her flowers because she's still doing it 25 years later, like she's still one of the baddest bitches. It's all in, in how she talks and how she walks. She was that girl and still is that girl. Trina's legacy is longevity, very loyal, and the baddest bitch. He's bad. He's bad. He's bad.